and you run come back to Jamaica like an idiot. So that when I remember that what I'm saying, it motivates me, push me, push me harder for work harder and stay on ship and do what I do. Welcome to my Canadian lifestyle movement from Jamaica to Canada. Yo, what's up YouTube? So I'm there. So now I'm gonna show the first footage on the vlog camera. Hopefully you can hear me good. Snow still up on the ground, but otherwise we have good weather today, isn't it? Not too bad. Still kind of cold because I want to pull over and thing. So, anyways, so I'm going to promise you know, um, a part two for the whole story time and shit thing. Yeah, I kind of go to parts to the see because I try to keep the vlog as short as possible because you know, nobody knows who I watch a long vlog. Or, so I've been told. Anyways, viewers and subscribers, remember the golden rule: rule like. Sh remember the golden rule: like, share, and subscribe. So I joined the ship. I think it was 2013 or 14. Yeah, somewhere there about. Anyways, um, before I went on the ship, like, like the day when I resigned from my job and I go up on the ship and my manager come to me and him say hmm he say he's on the work you know, and what, whatever whatever and you have to remember say the faster you go up on the ship but the faster you can come back to the yard so I say why is that? he say him they have a brother work on the ship and him brother the foolishness I know but we come back to the yard so I say okay then Anyways, I never bother to pay no mind because that does sound like a, you know, like a bad mind thing, like, them not happy for me. But anyways, um, I joined the ship, I go to Miami, and I joined the ship, and it was like amazing, you know, like, I said, yeah, I'm there, I'm up on the ship, is it? <laughs> anyways, um, immediately when I joined the ship, um, the first week of straight training, you have work and do training, work and the training, work and the training. So, that the kind of rough still is here, but they might prepare for if any emergency, like you know, ship or sink, you know, if you do, or you know, where for go, you know, just in case ship or sink or whatever. You understand what I'm trying to say? Anyways, so we do that, we do the training and whatnot every week it never pretty they rough because you have work 10 to 14 hours a day sometimes 16 hours a day and you have to do it Sunday to Sunday no days off for nine months straight so it never pretty they rough and I like you you see just in case nobody watches on one join the ship as a chef it never pretty anyways um Um, uh, it's a two weeks of training, no, one week of training, yeah. Anyways, you know, for cook for 3,000 plus people at the time, you know, pretty. Trust me. Like, the experience nice, you know, the experience nice, but it's not pretty at all. Yo, me, me just, uh, you have um, a thing called special cleaning also, when USPH for company ships. So you see, every Every time I cross over like to Europe and I come back into the US, I will stop at like a, a US country like, like you know like a US port. Like Puerto Rico or one of them places there. Them can't expect to get like US page for company ship and thing. But anyways, sometimes for months you have a special clean and no US page will come here as a clean, clean, clean. Them have been known and one of the things some flashlight, some black light, I look for dirt. I they may see a smudge. You have to go and go clean it and all them things there. You have to wake up early, early out of bed and go up and stand by. Yo, all them ship people in my watches. Ship on them and the ship come on them. You know, you know what I'm talking about. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Anyways, so 
you know, I never like that. I never like the whole USPH thing and the whole cleaning. Yo, yo, it just gets to me. To the way it gets to some people, them left to work. Them come to hell one week, come work and say, oh, this is slavery. I can't work to my country. It never matter means to lose it. But for the first two weeks we did the partnership, I remember I lie down in my room on the top bunk. I was a top bunk and bottom bunk to share a room with somebody, you know. I remember I lie down in my room and I look up in the ceiling and I say, God, I want to get myself in up. When we come on the ship for God it's tough. So but even start thinking I say I want to can go back uh, very smart and give up my job. Tears almost come me, yeah, God no. Anyways, when we, when we start thinking about that now, I remember, remember when, when my man just said, the quicker you go up on the ship, the quicker you can come back to the yard. And that kicked me in. And I said, oh shit, if I go back to Jamaica, run out of a ship and go back to Jamaica, the people my laugh for me, I said, oh, you get ship work and go on a foreign guy work and whatever. Remember me have friends where when them join the same time and they must say, oh dog, I can't take this no more because the woman the woman chef she not like me and she give me hard work and whatever, whatever. So I said, man, you just fight it, dog, just tough it out. And say, oh, I left this and go back and I go drive taxi, yeah, man. I said, alright, anyways, I stand strong, I stay there, I do my thing. Um, I don't do anything to bother me. Even though things don't bother me because people get to me, yo, if me for going on a full store partnership, it's a never, 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 never ending story. Trust me upon that. Um, I end up going on my thing, going on my thing, until I get promotion and everything, and I get like a higher level, a little higher level chef. The money never good. The money partnership shaky, shaky bad. And for my overseas subscribers and Viewers, when I understand what I mean by what I say, shaky, the money was bad, it wasn't good. Like, the money was really bad. As a starting cook, no matter how good it be, you could have been like a sous chef at Jamaica at the time, or whatever. They must them say as a, like a level one chef. Like, it, that, that wasn't good, you understand know what I say? So, I do it and do it, I do it for three and a half years. Yeah, we did three and a half contracts. And I decided to say, oh, I come off of this, like this, this is just too much, you know. I do it, I get the experience. Yo, trust me. I want to know the experience. People are the best in the world. On the ship, everything we can think about, the cookie on the ship. I put a frog foot or frog legs, as some people call it, or spring chicken. I put a that. Everything, every food we can think about, the on the ship, I will cook it. So it wasn't, it wasn't, anyway, let me stop talking about the bad them. You have good, you have good partnership also, you know, them keep a whole heap party for you, you know, welcome to the Caribbean party, welcome to Europe party, you know, Carib Caribbean party, Mexican, you know, Spanish party, sorry. Them keep a whole heap party for you, but just know say you have to go work in the morning, you understand what I say? If you miss work, them start announced over the intercom, call a room, they may get you. If you're drunk, yo, if you drink too much liquor over a certain, over, over a certain level, you're gone. I remember one time, I was on the ship and there was a fire on the ship. I don't know, the guy, they, 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 they must drink at the crew bar, you know, like the crew here or party or whatever, he must drink and drink too much. And him going in with a kickle. You know, you know them plug in electronic kettle, eh? plug it in the room and say, I'm gonna make some tea. And he must drop asleep with the kettle on. And when he drop asleep now, a beer smoke start coming from out time room. And it's like the kettle burn out and start a fire. And when it start the fire now, shit, everybody start panic because fire upon a ship at sea is one of the most dangerous things you can think about. Even me this time panic, I said, blow when I come on ship and ship I got bound with me out of the sea. I have a drop in the water, shark I got near me, I wheel I got swallow me. What's that thing I start to think? You know, I said, Jano Star, I'm gonna come on ship for one. Anyways, um, you know for that still.
Anyways, them they drag him out of the room and them out the fire and whatever, you know, and thank God nothing bad them happened. I rest more day today, I talked to you know. And we all that swallow me around shark with near me. Yeah, so that was part of my experience on the ship. I can't, I can't tell them everything like just now because I too much. You understand me, I say? I'm mean, probably have to go in on story time part three, but just don't say ship on a bed of roses. It's good, the experience is good, but on a bed of, on a, on a bed of roses, it's very tedious, te technical, trust me. You have, to, you have to want it, you have to work hard, you have to want it, you have to want the experience, you have to stay there and do your thing or whatever, and not to watch your face. You know, but it is tough still because at the time having a you know like a, a serious relationship with a girlfriend or whatever and you're gone for months, she had to live come in her yard, she wanna see you. But you know so if you go back to Jamaica you're not gonna make that much money. Jamaica money a joke thing for me. You see it. Um it is rough still, isn't it? But I might have to go in a part three. You see, because see that the vlog gone out 11 minutes already. You see, I'm kind of keep it. I try kind of kind of keep it short. But overall, still the ship was fun. It never easy, but it was fun. You know, I see a whole different country. Yo, you see, you see, I try. I see a whole different country. I go over 75 different countries in the world. I stop stress on that. I travel the world already. Alu, no got so much country can't chat to me. You know, say no phone no go, can no phone no ship people will watch this. No phone my friend them will watch this. But I say, oh, I go more than that than whatever. But anyways, I'm kind of glad to say I go to whole um, 75 different countries of the world. And you know, I travel the world. I go, I go my favorite um, football club, um, Spain. I go Barcelona, Spain. You know, um, I go to the stadium. I go camp now, hoping for say. Messi and Suarez and Neymar and them and them, and them on the day, but they never did it. They never play one match the next day. So if it was that day they made me go, you know, my could have gone and see them and glimpse on them, but you know, um, they never did it. But go my next football, my next favorite football club um, team, country, which is Argentina, if we we'll never know. You know, Argentina was fun also. Um, I got Portugal, I got Portugal, I got Cristiano Ronaldo there. We got Greece, we got France, we got Italy, well, Italy, Greece, same thing. We got uh, Montenegro, we got Uruguay, Chile, yo, we got Rock of Gibraltar, or Gibraltar, but the Rock of Gibraltar did it still. So, we got a whole heap of different countries in the world, so listen, I'm really enjoying myself, I'm really enjoying my time. But, anyways, guys, I'm gonna try to keep the vlog short. I might have to go do one part three. Might. I'm not sure yet. I don't know yet. But just tell me one thing about this experience. And if any of you guys can relate to, you know, what my manager said to me. And think it's a bad mind thing or whatever, you know, drop a comment down below. And like, share, and subscribe. And make sure, make sure you want to subscribe. Do. Make sure you want to subscribe. Is it. So, as I said, the new camera this, what I use, what I kill up myself will get, you know, um, quality content. Big up on yourself, and thanks for watching my vlog movement. Big up. Yeah, guys, so that said, um, I just made some food. See, healthy, sweet potato, piece of yam, shrimp and veggies, you know. So, with that said, I close out the vlog gas up can I eat some food now and remember like share and subscribe to my channel you know I have a whole heap of cooking video come soon also you know I start out with some basic stuff so stay tuned and look forward to it alright bless up